SEO Power Suite provides everything you need to increase search traffic under one roof. How do I know? Because I've been using it for nearly 10 years. In fact, I published my first SEO Power Suite review way back in 2013, and it's one of my core tools that helps give me the edge over the competition. So, I'm also going to show you 12 different ways that you can use SEO Power Suite to increase your search traffic. Because I use it from everything from website audits to link building. And if you're on a budget, they have a free version available to download as well. You'll get access to four individual tools that focus on different aspects of SEO. Website Auditor helps you find and fix on-site problems. SEO Spyglass will download and analyze your competitors' backlinks. Link Assistant is an all-in-one link building and outreach tool. And all of that is backed up by Rank Tracker that tracks rankings across nearly every country and device you can think of. So, enough talk. Let's drill down into the nitty gritty because I want to show you 12 different ways that you can use SEO Power Suite to increase your search traffic. Website Auditor is the perfect tool to find and fix all of your on-site SEO problems. And if you're serious about increasing your search traffic, you should always start with on-site SEO. So, I'm going to show you three ways that you can use Website Auditor to build a solid SEO foundation that Google will love. I'm going to show you how to perform a one-click audit of your site, how to perfectly optimize content for your target keywords, and show you how to do advanced on-page SEO with term frequency inverse document frequency analysis. First, we need to start with an SEO audit. So, launch Website Auditor and enter the domain that you want to analyze and click Finish. Then, come to the Site Structure Audit section in the top left corner. Here, you can see a summary of the errors that were found and you can click on any of the errors below to see which pages are affected and learn more about the error. Here, you can see that I have a bunch of 404 errors that I need to fix. And if we scroll down, you'll also see I have some various issues with broken images and duplicate meta descriptions to take care of. You should work through all of the issues that Website Auditor finds and then fix them. Once you've done that, you can start auditing individual pages on your site to make sure that they are perfectly optimized for their target keyword. To do that, go to Content Analysis, Page Audit and click to add a new page. Select the page to optimize from the list, click Next and enter your target keywords before clicking Finish. Website Auditor will then perform a complete page analysis and come back with a list of recommendations to improve your page level optimization. For example, my free SEO tools post is likely over optimized. And if we click on the technical tab, you can see it's also suffering from a problem with uncompressed images. All you have to do is work through each of the pages you want to increase rankings for on your site and take care of the problems you find. Because, well, once you've taken care of site level and page level optimization, we can get into the more advanced things like term frequency, inverse document frequency analysis, otherwise known as TFIDF. Basically, this is an algorithm that Google are known to use that calculates how important a specific word is over a collection of documents. So, if the top 10 results use the word download, then your page needs to use it as well. Website Auditor has a class-leading TFIDF tool built in, which you can access by going to Content Analysis, then TFIDF. You can either look at pages you've already done a page level analysis for by using this drop down or click here to add a new page. If we look at this report for my best WordPress hosting case study, you can see that I need to use the term WordPress hosting providers more and add terms like WordPress website and SSL certificate, which are used by nine of my competitors. Just work through this report and follow the recommendations in this column. Once you've done that, your pages will be perfectly optimized based on current real-world data. 
Link Assistant is a great tool to help you find link building opportunities in any niche. It has a few great features that help me to automate the outreach process, such as building targeted outreach lists, automatically looking up email addresses, and bulk sending emails. Let me show you how easy it is to set up a campaign. Just enter the URL of the web page you want to build links to and click on the Look for Prospects button. Here, you can select what type of link you want to build. You can choose from guest posts, reviews, comments, giveaways, link pages, and seven other different types of links. But let's keep it simple with guest posts. Just add your target keywords and click through the wizard. Once it's finished, you will have a complete list of sites that are waiting for your guest post pitch. You can see this returned over 1,200 guest posting opportunities in total, along with other information like domain authority and page authority. The next thing you want to do is look up the contact information for the sites you want to guest post on. To do that, you can either click here to update all of the results, or you can select the results you want to update, right click, then click update and select contact info here. Link Assistant will then go out and harvest all of the contact details for all of your guest post opportunities. Once you've done that, reaching out to your prospect list is easy. Just select which sites you want to target and click the mail button here. Then all you need to do is select a mail template or import your own from this dropdown and press send. That's it. Link Assistant will start sending out the emails immediately or you can set them on a schedule. Pretty simple, right? Not only that, but Link Assistant will automatically track all of your outreach so you've always got a handle on what is going on, no matter how many emails you send. It really is an all-in-one tool that makes it easy to find, contact, and manage outreach-based link building campaigns. SEO Spyglass is a great way to figure out how your competitors are ranking by stealing their best backlinks. Then you can use them to increase your own search traffic. It's like the Robin Hood of SEO tools. So I'm gonna teach you a few ways to use it to your advantage. First, you can use it to execute one of my favorite SEO strategies of all time. And that is to simply steal all of your competitors' best backlinks. All we have to do is download a list of their links and then review each one to figure out how we can replicate it for ourselves. To do that, open SEO Spyglass and enter your competitor's URL and click finish. Once it's finished downloading all of the backlinks, you can go to the backlink profile and backlinks report to see a list of backlinks pointing to your competitor's URL. You can filter for different link types here and see things like which anchor text is being used. But the real magic of this report comes if you export it to use with my free spreadsheets that will help you to build an intelligent link building strategy using the data from SEO Spyglass. So download those now if you don't have them already. Next, you can use the domain comparison tool to see how your link profile stacks up against your competitors. This is a great way to get a quick overview of your backlink profile and gives you a benchmark to improve upon. I suggest running this report monthly to see how you and your competitors are progressing in terms of link building, because you can be sure that your competitors are working just as hard as you. And don't forget to drill down into the link intersect report to see where your competitors are getting links you aren't. One of the other cool features of SEO Spyglass is you can connect it to Google Analytics and Google Search Console to pull down additional data about your backlinks, like how much traffic they're sending. Just come to the backlink profile and then referral traffic to see this data because you can be sure that the backlinks that are sending you traffic will also be helping you to earn new backlinks. So it might be worth following up with those sites that are sending you traffic to see if there's any room to work together further. Rank Tracker is the most comprehensive rank tracking tool on the market. It allows you to check rankings for as many different keywords and URLs as you want, 
up to a thousand search results deep. And you can do that across 500 different search engines all around the world, including Google, Bing, Yahoo, DuckDuckGo, Yandex, and across mobile and desktop. Not only that, but it also tracks universal search results in Google like images, videos, news, shopping, places, books, real-time results, and the ability to track local rankings, Google Maps, YouTube videos, and competitor rankings with no limits on the number of keywords you can track. I mean, can you name another rank tracking tool that does all of that? And the best bit of Rank Tracker is that you own your data because this is a desktop tool that doesn't rely on the cloud. And seeing as I've been using it for like 10 years, I want to share three ways that you can use Rank Tracker to help your SEO efforts. The first thing that you need to do with Rank Tracker is create a new project and follow the wizard. I won't bore you with the details because it's pretty straightforward and I want to get straight into my first tip. And that is to make sure that you enable the keyword difficulty column. To do that, just click here, then scroll down to the keyword difficulty section and enable the one you want to monitor like this. And then you'll see it right here. In fact, this little menu has lots of hidden data that you can enable, such as this Google SERP features column. So make sure you spend some time poking around in there. You can also use Rank Tracker to steal all of your competitors' best keywords, which you can then import into the free spreadsheet that I built that will filter out tire kicker keywords and help you build an intelligent keyword strategy in minutes. Go and download it now if you haven't already. And then you can come back and use the ranking keywords tool in Rank Tracker to steal your competitors' keywords in one click. Next, I want to show you how to fully automate your rank checking. Just do that by setting up the scheduler. Come to Preferences, Scheduler, and choose your options. You can have it run daily, weekly, or monthly. And you can also have it automatically update other keyword data like search volumes. Once you've set that up, Rank Tracker will go and check your rankings for you when you decide automatically. <laughs> and I nearly forgot. You can also track rankings for other pages or properties in search results, such as YouTube videos or guest posts or infographics. For example, I like to know where my YouTube videos are ranking in Google search, along with where my blog posts are ranking. So to do that, just go to preferences and alternative URLs and paste in any URL that you want Rank Tracker to track. Then, the next time you update the rankings, it will tell you if any of the URLs you enter here are ranking for your target keywords. You can add things like social profiles, guest posts, slide share documents, or any content that you've created that is not on your site. This is one of the greatest hidden features of Rank Tracker. And if you're interested in tracking your YouTube video rankings on the YouTube search engine and Google search engine, well, you can do that as well. Just go to Preferences, Preferred Search Engines, and then Enable YouTube and hit OK. Then just press this little button here to add the YouTube ranking columns. When you've done that, you'll be able to see where your YouTube videos rank in Google in this column and the SERP analysis section below. And you'll be able to see where they rank in YouTube search right here. Rank Tracker is by far the most fully featured rank tracker on the market, and it has you covered no matter what you want to track without any annoying limits. Plus, it leaves you in full control of your data. So, as you can see, SEO Power Suite truly provides everything you need to increase your search traffic under one roof. And even though I just showed you 12 ways to use it in this video, I share an additional 12 ways that you can use it in the full post on my blog. And don't forget, there's a free version of SEO Power Suite available for you to download if you are on a budget. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask below and don't forget to hit the subscribe button to make sure you get more videos like this one.